how to use a firearm, keep on your safety, and what I do wrong, Alexander. Somebody tell Charles Sergeant Alexander, stand down. Stand down, Sergeant Alexander. I know you're peeping from a false profile. You understand? But we're going to get to the fucking point, you know. I just want to clear the air first because you try to put me in a bad light and bring me down. You understand me? I'm talking about gun business and gun business. I'm in Miami, Florida. Think, na jackass. Think. I go on and give them a little gun tutorial to let her, you know that Trinidad killer know about fucking guns. I never say I go in and kill nobody. I go in and do this. I just have my firearm for my personal use to protect my fucking self. Florida is a gun state. A big, big sergeant like you don't know that. A big sergeant like you, Alexander, do not know that Miami, Florida is a fucking gun state. And guns is legal over here. What I do wrong? To have me on television and thinking and die zero own model. And to, I realize Trinidad and Tobago that always try to fucking bring me down. You know? They trying to bring me fucking down. What I do wrong, Alexander? That is what I want to ask you tonight. Senior super intelligent. Senior super. Hmm? I just clear in the air. I want the people on the live to tell me. If I do anything wrong, say Trinidad killer, you're wrong. You understand me? Stand down. If Alexander wrong, tell him stand down. Alexander, stand down. Mm -hmm. You can cry guns in Florida without a license. The other day I in Florida. So a police jeep pull we fucking over. Yeah, them, you got any guns in the car? I say, yes, sir, I got two guns. And I pull it down. They see the fucking gun. They check the fucking document. And they say, you go ahead, sir. You understand? It's a fucking gun state we in. We in a fucking gun state. So if I show me firearm and I show a little tutorial on the internet, why are you putting me on national fucking television? Why are you putting me on national television to try to make me look bad? But I come for you to fucking night. This is where we're going and start the fucking ball are rolling. Are you get boy? This is where you get me fucking mad on Alexander. You get me fucking mad on Alexander. You see how under my Guinness here. You get me mad, Sergeant Alexander. That is what you're doing, me boy. I realize you're a wicked man. You beat up fucking Ian Allen. You used to ride with Ian fucking Allen. Yeah, what I'm telling you. Sergeant Alexander, you used to ride with Ian Allen. And you bad mind fucking Ian Allen. And you do and and you fucking make the do Ian Allen all kind of thing. We know you is a wicked man, you know. You is the man who representing Trinidad and the fucking Bego. I know you're going to try to fucking kill me. But I ain't care what I say. I ain't care what I say. You bad mind, Ian Allen. Ian Allen, bring you out. Heart soft goes out to Ian Allen. Ian Allen, bring you out. He bring you on the program. And show you the ropes. You beat up the man down by Sharon. And you pull this one with the man named Honkin soon or what and you start your own fucking program. So the whole public could see you as a bad mind officer. And you know what? You take him off a television. I talk in my mind tonight. The whole nation seeing what fucking going on. If a lion tell me a lion. You beat up Ian Allen down by Sharon's. You take him off the TV because the TV is a government station to bring a program. You're bringing a program on television. What you're saying is, what is the name of the thing? What is the name of the program? Somebody give me. Somebody give me now. Marlon. You and Marlon. You and Marlon. Or you bring a program, or you bad mind Ian Allen. 
or you take him off the TV. So he on Allen had a stream from Synergy now and all kind of platform or you fight him down. Ian Allen was doing the work. Ian Allen was doing the work. Be on the tape. Be on the tape. That is where you take where the work for when Ian Allen strike. When Ian Allen strike. He holding teeth, he holding criminal, he holding this, you're jealous the fucking man, Alexander. You're jealous the fucking man. You understand? You're jealous Ian Allen. You're jealous fucking Ian Allen. And you bring your own program beyond the fucking tape. And you're only showing where you want to fucking show. I is the voice of the poor people in Trinidad and Tobago from today. You're only showing on beyond the tape where you want to show. One in your colleague who killed all the witness down by courts. But I want you to fucking know the policeman who killed the three people and two still fucking wounded. We're going to protest and put you in jail for life because you're a thief. That is what we want to see. We want to hear the story with the policeman who killed the people, who take the people money. And when they find out, yeah, he running racket, he kill all the witness. Now a mother crying for Christmas because she two son gone. Oh yeah, that's how we go. Yeah, yeah. You putting up me with a fire in my heart, but your colleague, super Alexander, your colleague. We got the voice note here. We had the voice note here. Where he making arrangement to drop off stove. And he making arrangement to drop off fridge. And he making arrangement to drop out couch set. And he making arrangement to drop off this. And when the people show up by the place to collect key items. And they realize they're going on a razor alarm. He tried to kill every one of them. But two survived. To survive, so who is the real criminal? Who is the real criminal? Why ain't showing that on beyond the tape? Why ain't showing that on beyond the fucking tape? That is what I want to ask you, Alexander. Why ain't showing that on beyond the tape? The policeman who killed the innocent people in court car park. We want to see that on beyond the tape. Why? That is your colleague, so you're breaks in. That is a I show in a firearm and teaching a tutorial in a gun state. Where firearm is illegal. That is where you're showing. While a mother holding she fucking belly because she womb reached down by she fucking cat. Because they spread out she, a policeman, one in your colleague. Spread out. Spread out. Spread out. Spread out. She too fucking son. So Christmas, now she Christmas sour. Because you kill the people for their own money. And you're not showing that on television. Show me that. That is what we want to see. We boycotting beyond the tape. Eh? You see that program beyond the tape? We boycotting that. We ain't watching that a fucking game. We boycotting beyond the tape. Beyond the tape get X out. If they can't really show the real criminal and the real thief and the real people who fucking up the system, we not watching beyond the fucking tape. Let me be fair. You kill the woman, son and daughter, that policeman, for their own money. You understand me? Why ain't showing that on beyond the tape? Tell me, Keith Christopher Rowley. I am calling on Keith Christopher Rowley. We need this matter to be investigated and go to, on all social media platforms. We want to see it on televisions. We want to see it on TT News. We want to see it on MYOB. The police who kill the innocent people. We put in here. We put in here in jail. We put in here in jail. Fear is fear. Fear is fucking fear. Now the woman, you 
kill the woman's son and daughter, boy. Keep Christopher Rowley. Or you get rid of Gary Griffith. Because are you know Gary Griffith too honest? Or you get rid of Gary Griffith, Gary Griffith too honest? You understand me? Gary Griffith not on that, you know. You do the crime, you have to serve the fucking time, you know. We put in back Gary, we miss you. Gary Griffith, I want you to know we miss you as commissioner of police. In spite of what they say about you, Gary Griffith, you used to have the place hot. You understand me? So they get out, all the men and them who straight. They get out Ian Allen, they push out Ian Allen. They push out Gary Griffith because Ian Allen had a connection with Gary Griffith. And two of them used to work because them not on about favoritism. You know, you do the crime, you have to serve the fucking time. You push out them. And now you come so you could run on your fucking racket. Or you don't understand what's going on in you know, Trinidad. Trinidad, or you don't understand what's fucking going on in you know. the system born to oppress black fucking people, you know. Are you seeing it every day and still black people wouldn't stand up with black people? The police is the real fucking thief and the police is the real bandit. They go on in Kima house and the beat and go on with all she fucking gold. When the girls start to make a scene and I come up and I fucking defend she, you know, all the fucking gold come back. So who is really the thief? Who is really the fucking criminal? We lost all faith in the Trinidad and Tobago police service. We lost all faith in the police service of Trinidad and Tobago. We need to reshuffle. We need to reshuffle. We lost all faith in the police service in Trinidad and Tobago. Where is Kima Gold? We lost all faith in the police service of Trinidad and Tobago. I want to say that on a live now because are you for yourself? Are you for your fucking self? Are you police? Are you fucking police? We're not listening that by news before news and TT news. Your mother can't buy. I want to tell you that by TT news and news before news. Or your mother can't buy. Or you just only highlight fucking ghetto youths. When ghetto youths doing something bad to look to bring down a fucking ghetto youth. We're not riding with fucking or you. We go report on your page and let it pull it down. If or you can inspire we ghetto youths. Or give we get to use no kind of strength within we music or whatever we doing. We going to report or you and pull down on your fucking page, boy. As a man come up with a gun or you want to pull up that and or you fucking pull up that. Pull up the police and them who thief in, who running in fucking people. It's thief. It's thief in police fucking uniform. I set a thief in police uniform. I set a criminal in police uniform who doing the most set of fucking crime. Who doing the most set of fucking crime? It's thief in police uniform. The police service are the most set of fucking thief. And the most set of fucking corruption. Alexander, all are fucking. Oh, yeah, 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 thing going by. Oh, yeah, oh, yeah, fucking cherry life. Oh, yeah, oh, yeah, thing going in, Alexander. I on you and know, Alexander. Because I ain't doing nothing for poor people and black people. I'm only killing poor people and black people, children. But Alexander, I talking to you, boy. I don't care about you, boy. I tell you that, boy. Big man talking to you. I used to have a respect for you. I used to have a respect for you, you know, Alexander. But I turn my back on fucking you now. You understand? No, you're thief. Oh, are you? Are you selling guns? Are you selling drugs? Are you selling cocaine? Are you taking weed from this block, putting it on that block? Are you taking guns from here, selling it there? Are you get a fucking walk? A man pay all your money, or you swing, or you kill fucking people? Are you doing the most set of fucking crime, boy? Are you at the place of it is, boy? Are you police at the place of it is today? I say so. I fucking say so. See, are you get rid of Gary Griffith? Or you get rid of Gary Griffith and or you get rid of Ian and then I have to bring back them fucking people, boy. Or you have to bring back them fucking people. Or you taking guns, crying it on this block, taking weed, crying it on this block, the gun day, or you get a hundred, or you go on with fucking care and praise money. You see your fucking colleagues putting the money in the jersey on camera, 
Nobody. What come out of that? And oh, you want to fight on the man, Karen fucking priest. Wow. You have to start to support black businesses. Karen priest, big up yourself. Or you actually see the police putting the money down inside fucking day. Nobody ain't highlighting that. It's thief in the police fucking service. I can put my faith in your hand. I not coming back to that for you to kill fucking me. Alexander, I seeking asylum. I go into the fucking United States Embassy and say the police in Trinidad and Tobago want to kill fucking me. I'm not coming back because I'm talking the fucking thing so I'm over here. If you feel like you come back to Trinidad for you to sneak up on me and put a bullet in my fucking head, you lie. Or your police is thief. I want you to know that. Or your police in Trinidad and Tobago fucking is thief. Or you is thief. Or you is the worst set of fucking thing. In Trinidad, oh, I have a gun and are you thinking guns is legal in fucking Florida? Are you thief care and priest money? Are you, are you could have make an innocent black man fucking dead you know? care and priest? Are you could have make people kill fucking priest in you know? a DSS you know? Because you know why DSS come up with a fucking strategy to give black people money. So in front of DSS house is fucking carnival, everybody fucking dancing. Cause this one calling this one hand today. I call it 21 today. How much are you hand are inside? How much are you shut down fucking that? Because you know why? Black people getting money and it forming a fucking unity. You understand? No, you shut down that. Make the man look bad and want people to kill the fucking man. But are you thief? I say so. I say so. Put this on beyond the fucking tape. I want you to put this live and be on the tape, Alexander. Yeah. Karen Freeze had a nice thing going. Are you support priest? Black business pawn shop. It's Christmas. If you go buy priest with your TV, you're getting money for it. You go buy priest with your stove, you're getting money for it. You go buy priest with a fucking car, you just have to have your receipt and your thing legit and you get your little money for Christmas, you pawn it. Come with a different way to be the system now. Support the man. And once you get back the money, or you go get back a little thing on the fucking back end. By my friend, I could tell you how we does operate. You understand? Now if you have a stove, you have an old fucking car, you have a fridge, you have gold cry it up by the pawn shop. Cry it up by the pawn shop this fucking Christmas. Karen Breeze. That is the pawn shop. Is by the lights in mousy cars you swing and you go right walk in the your car selling you can take out and support black businesses let me uplift with black brothers and sisters you understand we ain't dealing with no stolen items though so don't feel like you can thief somebody thing and try back here and please no we're not dealing with that but if you have a TV on it on your name and you have a receipt and you're looking for a little fucking change, cry it up by Karen Priest. If you have a fridge and you're looking for a little fucking money and it's on your name, you have the receipt for it, cry it by Karen Priest. You'll get a little money and if you can't take it out or you don't know how the thing does go, somebody else go own it. If you can't take it out and the interest bill too high, you call it dead and somebody else come with a small change and end up with it. That's how the business does go. I praise a lie. Karen praise a lie. Hear me come in. Smokey, if you get in a jam and you have your fucking laptop and you feel you can get a 2500, you need a 2500 fast, cry your laptop, you will get a 25. Karen praise pawn in any fucking thing. Anything once you have your fucking receipt, cry it. The number one pawn shop. No stolen fucking articles. It's Christmas. And Karen Priest is a good fucking fella. I want to tell you fucking that Karen Priest. And I praying for you, you go win that case. Sir. I don't see you go win that fucking case. You see that case with them police and them, they can't win you at all. You understand me? But the only thing when you win the case, I hope the media in alarm it. Karen, please get back all the fucking money so people go want to kill your fucking game. You gotta buy a fucking piece of land somewhere by Abby and go on up there and fucking live. Because everybody lost, you know. Once you get back that fucking money, people who not even have a part of the fucking DSS saying they lost fucking money to you. You have to understand how this fucking thing does go in a priest. You understand? So I, once you win that case and you get back that little money, my advice for you go on a small island, you buy a little fucking property and you do your thing, you disappear. Because once you win that fucking money, boy, you telling fucking me.
people who don't have a hand saying they put 10,000 and this and that. I don't know how you're going on fucking shit. If I was you, I would have told you what's going on. You see that fucking case? I'm leaving that fucking case alone. If I was you, keep freeze and leave that fucking case alone. Let it keep the fucking body. Because when you feel you come out and forget job, it's more job you're going to do. Okay, oh, this one lost, and this one lost, and I ain't give up my body yet. And this and all kind of fucking thing. But you don't know how you think does go. I just try to be real and keep it fucking real. You understand? I just try to snap from a black brother's boy. Time for black people to come together and start to unite and let we make it fucking happen. You understand me? Let me make it.